All right, sorry about that. Here we go. All right, so I was running in uh, through Gloversville, if you're familiar with this stretch along the rail trail. Um, and uh, I figured I would show you. This is what's called channeling. In other words, we've taken the water um, because it runs through the city and we've channeled it um, into a specific area just to keep it um, from moving back and forth. You can see it's very straight. Um, this happens to be a very deep section um, of the of the creek, but if you look downstream here, over here, this is what stream channeling does. So when you channel the stream up upstream, as it flows downstream, the speed gets too quick to make the turns. And so you can see back here where it's cut that bank back quite severely all the way around. So eventually, um, this stream still wants to go straight because the power, right, or that strength, or the energy of the stream is actually pushing it towards that corner over there. And so eventually it's going to tear that out um, unless they reinforce it and, uh, you know, coming back across. So channeling, while, you know, it seems like a good idea to keep the up part of the stream, um, you know, from damaging any of the land around it, downstream, you can see the evidence of, uh, you know, what it causes downstream uh, because of the channeling upstream. So I just thought I'd show you that. Notice it's moving faster on the outside of the corner, slower on the inside. Um, and we'll talk more about that as we go along.